ਡੰਡਾਉਤ ਬੰਦਨ ਅਨਕ ਬਾਰ ਸਰਬ ਗਲਾ ਸਮਰਥ ਡੋਲਣ ਤੇ ਰੱਖ ਹੋ ਪ੍ਰਭੂ ਨਾਨਕ ਦੇ ਕਰ ਹੱਥ ਤੇਰੇ ਜੋਰ ਮੈਂ ਗੁੰਗਾ ਕਹਤਾ ਹੂੰ ਤੇਰਾ ਸਦਕਾ ਤੇਰੀ ਸ਼ਰਨ ਸਤਨਾਮ ਸ੍ਰੀ ਵਾਹਿਗੁਰੂ ਸਾਹਿਬ ਜੀ ਗਾਈ ਰੰਗ ਬਰੰਗ ਬਹੋ ਵਾਹਿਗੁਰੂ ਜੀ ਕਾ ਖਾਲਸਾ ਵਾਹਿਗੁਰੂ ਜੀ ਕੀ ਫਤਿਹ ਤਨ ਤਨ ਸਤਿਗੁਰੂ ਸਾਹਿਬ ਸ੍ਰੀ ਗੁਰੂ ਗ੍ਰੰਥ ਸਾਹਿਬ ਜੀ ਦੀ ਗੁਰੂ ਖਾਲਸਾ ਸਾਧ ਸੰਗਤ ਵੀ ਬਲੈਸਟ ਅਗੇਨ ਟੂ ਬੀ ਗਦ ਟੂਗੇਦਰ ਲਰਨਿੰਗ ਫਰਮ ਦ ਵਾਰਾ ਆਫ ਪਾਈ ਸਾਹਿਬ ਪਾਈ ਗੁਰਦਾਸ ਸਾਹਿਬ ਜੀ the vara that have been blessed is the key to understanding gurbani and gursikhi so we can all learn and understand gursikhi better hopefully becoming one with wahiguru breaking free from the tarasi lakjun pai sahib ji in these podia in the second var are describing how through one wahiguru everything else is created and within the existence of wahiguru within the creation we the creation can understand realize and enjoy the essence of wahiguru realizing and experiencing themselves within ourselves so pai sahib ji is going to use the example in this 13th body of a cow and the milk that a cow gives to show that how that pleasure is is existent in all of the creation satnam sri wahiguru sahib ji gai rang barang baho dud ujjal varna so even though cows are different colors when they give milk the milk is white ujjal it's pure uh, it, it's all white so even though cows can be dark and dark is associated with negativity the milk is still white it's still positive so dod the sare gaan dinde han so god wahiguru as example of a cow not to say that we uh worship cows by sahib ji just given an example as they've done in previous body and they've used gold they've used a lamp they've used different examples they used sugar cane in the last body in this one they're using a cow so wahiguru gives its blessing its jyot which is the example of the milk within all of the creation so what happens to that milk dodd dahi jamai ya we can make yogurt dahi with that same dodd karne he chal tarna so when obviously jadu jamai da ya we put obviously uh if you will you could call it rennet in the dahi jama ke rakh de ha raat nu in a hot place sweer nu dahi ban janda ya so we make dahi from that same dud at the same time dahi viloi aloi ya shahe makhan tarna we can make uh, butter we can make cheese uh, dud nu wala de ke paneer bana ke we can make cheese we can make butter at the same time makhan tai outai ke kyo nirmal karna from that same dud that has come from the cow that same milk we uh, we can make desi kyo pure ki kyo if you will pure butter uh, when uh, the milk is then developed and then boiled over and over we can make desi kyo so from the same milk we can make kyo we can make cheese we can make dahi yogurt we can make uh, makkhan we can make all sorts so the essence is wahiguru but the essence can come in different forms hom jag nai ved kar sab karaj sarna and then obviously that butter is then used uh, as offering used to make food and then it's used to make offerings uh, and worship uh, is performed using that kyo that's what people do so if we think of wahiguru wahiguru uh, is one they create the creation they exist within that creation and then that jyot within us allows us to worship themselves so different forms no matter what form we become what caste color creed background we come from we can still give those same offerings to wahiguru by repeating the name of wahiguru as pai sahib ji describes gurmantar in the 49th body of the last var and at the end of this body ape aap vart da gurmukh hoye jarna so the gurmukh realizes that and is content that wahiguru exists within themselves because they know ape ap vartada bi wahiguru di kirpa naal hi sab kuch hunda ya with the wahiguru existing in us allows them to bless us so we can become one with wahiguru we can become that desi ki or that pure butter that then is part of those offerings and that worship to a kalpur wahiguru if i've made any mistakes or offended anybody sad sangat ji you bless me so i can continue sharing the teachings of pai gurdas ji avara so we can all walk on that path understanding gurbani gursikhi better deho sajjan si sidiya jo ho bas aap se mail lekh ka tehna shuti khen khen pulan har baksan har baksle nanak par utar ape aap varat da gurmukh hoye jarna wahiguru ji ka khalsa वाहे गुरु जी की फतेह मेरी कलाओं